platform. Of course, there's the 25th anniversary edition. One. There's the WNBA di edition. <laughs> this? What is this shit? <laughs> Are you, uh, just, what? This is WNBA, there's the Kobe Bryant edition, there's the Black Mamba edition, there's the Actually four different editions of the same game. Wow. What a surprise. <laughs> the anniversary edition. Notice how in every single one of these, we don't put the prize in. Open it. What did I say? The WNBA version. $69.99. 69 Kobe Bryant, $70. $100. $100 for the Black Mamba 2024 NBA edition. 100 buckaroos. Game. $100 game. And 25th anniversary edition. $100. What? That. So this is oh $170. Oh is this God. not getting out of control? But the thing is that like if that's only like $12 a month. Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest 2K in existence. And look, we have an extremely important video today. It is time to stand up for you, the consumer, the viewer. You know, a lot of our most popular creators are not standing up for you, okay? And I'm gonna tell you why. And hopefully with these bigger creators outside of the community, these examples, it's gonna change their tune. Y'all know, y'all know, people only ride the wave to give them the numbers so they could be, you know, justified in the public image. We gonna body all of that. Asmin Gold speaking about uh, 2K24. You know, the Angry Joe guy speaking about 2K24. Agent Zero, Chris Smooth, Flight Reacts, etc. So when I show you these videos, right? They're not gonna call them toxic or nothing. They're not gonna say they doing it for impressions. They're gonna be like, yeah, buddy. <laughs> hey, this world is all about clout, my boy, okay? It's all about the numbers. It's not about what you say, it's about who says it. But before we get into any of that, y'all make sure y'all subscribe if you are new. Help me hit 276K.2. We are like 60 subscribers away. And make sure you hit that goddamn like button. It helps Young Swan grow. Now, firstly, before we get into the videos, any creator, okay, we gonna, we gonna go there, that is fine with the seasons, supporting the seasons, or is not bothered by the season, you, the consumer, needs to call them out, okay? No one's overreacting. Y'all check my last video if you want more context. Nobody is overreacting. These creators aren't stupid. They know that there are going to eventually, or now, going to be gameplay related things within the season, and they're going to entice you to basically have to or be at a big disadvantage and it's gonna make you basically wanna, like, like for instance, when you go play 2K, why do you upgrade your player so fast? Because others are doing it, right? You can't go out there with your 60 overall, you gonna get smashed by someone with the 80 or the 90 or the, you feel me? So they're gonna start to implement certain things to put you at a disadvantage to make you want to do this and that, okay? Sure, that's a human flaw, but they, it's predatory, bro. It's going too far. And it, it's going to keep being trickled in. These creators are not stupid. Look at their channel size. They're not dumb. They know they're going to do this. They don't care about you consumers in all reality, bro. Oh, year after year, it's going to keep being more and more expensive. Demi already said it before it was even a thing. I called it out. He said, what if for paid seasons, level 40, you got unlimited boost. Imagine that. Someone who's paying for that now has unlimited boost. What is that going to make everyone do? And then they're going to see the numbers and they're going to keep adding different things, more things, patch points. So you're going to be at a disadvantage as a consumer that wanna, don't want to spend a bunch of money. You, you, you get where I'm coming from? Until the outrage gets so big and y'all create a real rumbling and hold creators accountable for not having a problem with this, you won't see change and it's really y'all's fault but the creators too because they're your voice you create these guys have some self-respect you're, you're you're teaching people to have like a slave mindset just accept it nothing's going to change oh oh, oh. like bro no 
bro. <laughs> it's a slippery slope. Th this is why I had such a problem with the adrenaline. It's all a slippery slope. This is why I have a problem when they start patching certain such slippery slope. And it's common sense. This truly exposed a lot of creators. I've been telling y'all about this, but let's see what Asmund has to say. NBA 2K adds a $20 a month season pass to its annual basketball game. Oh, wow. Let's take a look at this. Uh-huh. $70 base game, $60 Xbox or PlayStation Online, one my career build, can't reassign skill points, $240 uh -huh. top tier season pass. For see, look. In the 2K community, we don't even know about this. In other games, you can reassign skill points. Say you spend money on something, you can then, and you want to change it, you can just reassign stuff, like switch it up, put it to someone else, respect. In this world, it's not like that. They make fun of us. They laugh at us, dog, for like what we accept. And they, they don't even know this is really 150 because they basically make it to where you have to use skill boost and Gatorade to be able to be competitive online, right? He don't know this. If he knew this, he would lose his mind, right? He don't even know that. $470. He don't even know how much the clothes cost, right? You feel me? Of course the clothes is really more optional than anything, but it's like, he don't, and then he don't know how hard it is to grind your player normally, you know? And nothing will carry over to NBA 2K25. <laughs> well, you know what? You get what you, <laughs> what you deserve. And Facts. people that kept making excuses about this stuff and saying, oh, that's fine. I just play the game for fun. Well, that's what they get. This is what you Facts. fucking get. <laughs> Sports games are trash. Yeah, people get uh, people get farmed by this. Facts. NBA and FIFA milking their fan bases since 10 years and they like it. Yeah. The thing is that most people that buy NBA 2K and FIFA, they're not on Reddit talking about video games. They're don't I always say this? I've been telling y'all, we have to become the Karens, the complainers, to, to get a change, bro. But no, it's lame. You're weird. You're crying. You're complaining. No, I'm telling you the truth. But in other communities, they don't, they would never allow something like this, bro. We got to change our ways to get change, my boy. Okay. Like, these are people that are at a bar. Yeah, these are people that do not get... <laughs> about this stuff they'll pay bar yo 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 he's violated he's violated he say all us are at bars y'all let me know if y'all be going to bars right violate them asmin bro they like it get the money and it's no problem people that play sports games are idiots so they're still gonna play it facts there it is. and i, I don't know if facts. That play sports games is an idiot i don't think that's necessary no 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 asmin you ain't gotta bro you're not gonna get no blowback bro they are idiots. They need to be told that they're an idiot. Even if you still gonna play it, to not have an outrage and hold creators accountable to push this message, so you're not gonna keep spending more and more year after year, especially when the American dollar is gonna be significantly lower and everything in life is going to go up. 2K is gonna keep going up. They saying a Jordan's gonna eventually cost $500? Bro, you're an idiot to not try to hold certain creators accountable just because they want to get wine and dine with the company, bro. Tighten up, man. Fight back. And something in life, bro. All it is is a message. You ain't got to go spaz on them. Just hold them accountable. Well, I'm not a sports game enjoyer, personally. But um, I think anybody that pays $470 a year for one is. That's definitely <laughs> true. Facts. What the hell is this? I took a break. First what am I looking at? Are you serious? NBA 2K24. I'll be honest, bro. Like, look at the dude's face. Wait, wait, oh, you can't see it. Are you serious? NBA 2K24. Skip, skip. If you don't know what this is, good! Because I don't know yeah. what it is. This is f***ing garbage is what it is. It is a mm -hmm. season pass to play basketball yep. in a 60 no Well, it's a season pass to play a video game that you can play basketball. You don't play basketball, you just need a ball, but no, no. Hey, hey, hey. I know y'all be trying to, y'all be trying to like, uh, go play outside. Stop it, bro. Like, come on, man. Stop it. Stop it. $70 <laughs> title with special editions. Oh, this is $70? I could have never guessed. $80, 90 $100. See, look, the, in their world, to have a season pass, the game's like usually free, bro. This day, now they want to take a season of basketball and throw a battle pass in it like it's mother Apex Legends, like it's uh -huh. a free to play game, like you're unlocking fucking uh -huh. gun skins. What are you unlocking shoe skins? You know, what? Uh -huh. Actually, probably that is one you thing will. you unlock. <laughs> you I will. bet you probably do unlock shoe skins. Look, 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 now look, that you bring that up, it's happening here. Look, look, he's trying to be funny. He has no idea. Great idea. Is this what you were dealing with? Is this this is new, right? This cannot be what you guys have been dealing with in the basketball world. For Got no FIFA. idea. FIFA is even worse. 
I don't know if FIFA's worse. I just think y'all don't know a lot about the 2K stuff, but I don't know if FIFA has like a my player thing. I hear their my player is, is less, uh, but yeah. While now, right? Somebody fighting me. If this is fucking normal, I'm over here in fucking football land yeah. when I'm really basketball land is on fire as well. Of course. What the f is happening to sports games? Are you? Is the problem, the reason why it works is because the people that play sports games are such, such Wormies, they're like, well, I can be in the Hall of Fame Facts. for 20 bucks, okay. Well, I get more experience, nice. Facts. And they never think about it again. Facts. Serious, and I've never really called out NBA except for the time they tried to mother in casino machines. What, they got rid of those? Why'd they get rid of the casino machines? That's a good idea. I don't oh. know nothing about, oh, damn, Cash, why they got you looking like that? Yep. <laughs> Modern <laughs> gaming in one picture. Oh, LSK, why oh, wait, got wait, you wait, looking like me. that, bro? Oh my god. Yo, why they got you oh. looking <laughs> Yo, why they doing y'all like that? Wow, 777. I don't know what to say anymore, Joe. This is the worst f***ing example I have ever, ever seen. This is so blatant that they are literally saying, f*** all y'all. Yeah. Mother machines i don't understand why the sports gamers take this year in and year out They're what do you mean man all right here we go getting and they open their wallets and they pay for this useless garbage so what is it what is this pass that you get what do you get in it oh well don't worry because the big change is now you have an option to pay an additional ten dollars per season to get a pro tier well what it's also twenty dollars for a second tier Every game now has two tiers of Battle Pass. Uh -huh. There's the Battle Pass, and then there's the Battle Pass with people that like to light their money on fire. Is it what grants you 40? Look, these guys know 2K is the leaders of this, bro. They know it's going to eventually trickle into their games overall. Y'all got to make a stand. I like, you know, I'm not saying all the, like, the boycott stuff. Like, that ain't, you know. But y'all can contact the brands. You feel me? Y'all can make them look very bad and get their ratings bad. It will make them chill. They're going to keep going until they get too much pushback. How far do y'all have to be pushed? $500? You feel me? A build? Like, how far do you got to be pushed to where you have to put in, to where you have to put in like two months or more to max out your player normally and everyone else has the option to just buy their players? When, when are y'all going, you know? It's never going to end. Premium and rewards, month, by the way, and additional month. 40 premium rewards because the normal, if you play the game for free, if you, what do you mean for free? If you play the game for the cost of the full retail yeah. purchase price, Damn. they're only going to give you 40 rewards. Yeah, but you only pay $70 for the game, you ain't going to get much. You pay them $10 more, <laughs> you're going to get 80 rewards. You hear that? You buy the game, you ain't going to get much. Damn. Rewards and some currency. <laughs> And said, if face, you want, bro. they're going to, if you want to go up even uh, another level, yeah, you can go to the Hall Lord. of Fame and get one additional immediate reward uh -huh. and a 15% XP booster and 10 level skips on this stupid- That's right, so if you want to spend extra money, you can, not, you can avoid having to play the game. Pointless progression system that has nothing to do with anything about basketball! You hear that? You hear that? Basketball is what we're talking about here, and we're talking about a paid season pass for a game that you've already played. Well, <laughs> Damn. If these companies are gonna do <laughs> they need to make sports games free. That's it. That's it, your sports. Uh, be careful what you wish for. You're going to be seeing that spinny thing come right back. Games are now free. I have declared. I, I already think they're going to eventually make it free. Maybe. I don't know. But, like, maybe 25, 26, 27. You know, they're going to have it in such a way to where we're spending so much money, bro, that they could really go without it and then increase their base. It would actually be smart. But they want to test this out and make sure everything's 100% that they're not going to lose out on money. I promise you. Player, that now you're going free to play. You're not charging oh, your audience seventy dollars oh, oh. every year for a, a sports game produced by Stake and DraftKings. Roster update and barely any additional features. Oh man, I can't wait to get to that. And if Matt yeah. sees this, forget about it. We're gonna have oh, you're it. gonna have the ultimate team plus season passes oh, for yeah. a season of football. They're Absolutely. gonna find some way to justify forcing you to spend another ten dollars oh, yeah. a month, twelve dollars oh, yeah. a month on oh, roster yeah. updates. Fucking know it's coming. So the, what, what? I just don't get it. And then they combine this with, hey, we're combining my career with my team so that you won't have to re see? earn rewards separately in those you modes see? anymore, like you were. About you so much. That should have already been implemented. That yeah, but you have to put a roadblock in the game in order to have people suck for getting rid of it. Because what do you think that's going to happen? Well, you put the ankle weights on the players, and then you keep them there for long enough, and then you take them off, and the players say thank you so much. You're damn. We love you. I can't. Believe
Y'all hear that? You hear that? The reason they're giving us bad rewards, because now they're probably going to give us a great reward. You feel me? It's genius. It's psychology, dog. I believe you would be kind enough to take these ankle weights off of me. Yeah, I, I mean, this is just how it is. This is the way the game is, man. This is the way that I, like, I don't know how, they, I don't know how sports games work, to be honest. So I don't. He doesn't understand that I don't think they really understand that it's not just skins and stuff. Like you have to create your player and the builder's very hard to people besides like, like someone like me, I'm not gonna be wasting money on builds, but for the majority of the community, it's very hard to make a build and it's very it's really trick and a lot of things you're not gonna know when you make your build especially when the game first come out and they can alter it in patches and all this di different type of stuff so the money you spent on certain builds that build might become way less optimal so then you are basically encouraged to make other different type of builds they don't know about this they they don't know this it's it's a whole like it's deep dog it's like damn like the 99.3 was a killer but now you don't need a 99.3 no more to be a killer you feel me so it's like why you still got it it's a 99 steel you know it was a killer but now you don't need it no more the 99 ball handle you know it's crazy but th but they gotta they gotta patch stuff but it's like th th this is why like y'all people be getting mad when people be asking for patches and stuff but it's like bro the games bro we know you spent 150 on your build but that's not our fault bro you gotta go at 2k and like if builds was more like 10 dollars or something then you know it wouldn't be such a big deal but i i guarantee i know i know what it might feel like for you you make a 99 dunk and then the 99 dunk basically get patched that must be that must suck like man you're like now i gotta go make another build that but the reason it's such a big deal is not because of people asking for the patches it's because the game costs so you feel me that's why that's a huge problem it's not a feature of this that is something that you should be doing yeah. to improve your basketball game year after year are you not sick of additional monetization 2k basketball fans no they're not the answer to that question is no you Facts. think that they're tired of it they're not well i am and i don't even play the game i have friends that play the game that i'm gonna exp if they don't stop it it's it's a fucking sad because sports gamers are like abused and battered wives they keep going back to their situation I think that they're more like north korean citizens damn actually. because like the batter wife, they Whoa. know that wrong. But North Korean citizens, they think that they're in the greatest country in the world. They think that, bro, everywhere else, people in America are eating rocks. Damn. And, and, and drinking piss. So it's like in North Korea, whenever they just have warm water to drink and bread, maybe, uh, you know, they think they got it pretty good. So it's like you have. This is actually kind of true. A lot of the 2K consumers, they don't really know how it works in other video games y'all really need to hear this bro you really need to hear this of the sports gamers and it's like to them they don't know any better they don't know anything like that this is all they've ever known they buy madden every year every other year that's it they so yeah know. they're much more like north he's korean right. citizens i would say than battered wives but i can hey. see what he's getting at it's true Jim, over and over and they complain and then they yell it out you need to stop this needs to stop you you need to speak out and if you're not going to do it oh. nobody's gonna do it they're gonna milk That's right you hear this you're gonna milk your little oh yeah oh it's like he's the thing is what's so funny about this is joe is 100 you hear right. this everything that he's saying is completely true you hear this and not a single person that needs to hear it is gonna see this video you're little gonna be so goddamn exactly. milked by the end of this thing yeah that it's you're not getting a good you're not getting the experience that you deserve for the amount of money you're that you're putting in. i think we can all agree that this now be free if you want to charge season pass, okay if uh, additional monetization on top and you could argue that the basket 2K is already overly monetized. This is why Joe doesn't bother with it. I don't bother with it. Madden, I only bother with Madden. That's over monetized with Ultimate Team because I like football. So if I like basketball more than football. Yeah, you'd be getting goofed around by this too. Imagine what happens to people that like Anime Girl. This would be my rage every <laughs> year. What? Those and guys it, are getting farmed. It just so happens that this year it exploded <laughs> about how now we're implementing season pass, yeah. free to play type things in games that don't even, aren't even set up for it. An additional ten dollars for pro, an additional twenty dollars for Hall of Fame, yep. on top of the seventy dollars, yep. and then the limited edition. I can look up the NBA 2K. How many editions are NBA 2K 24? Of course, there's a 25th anniversary edition. One. There's the WNBA di edition. What is this? What is this? <laughs> are you just what? This is w NBA. There's the Kobe Bryant edition. There's the Black Mamba edition. There's the actually four different editions of the same game. Wow, what a surprise! Uh, anniversary edition. Notice how in every single one of these, the 
put the fries in the but it. What did I fuck? <laughs> the WNBA version. $69.99. 69 Kobe Bryant, $70. Uh -huh. $100 for the Black Mamba 2024 NBA edition. A hundred buckaroos. In game. hundred oh, fucking game. And 25th anniversary edition. <laughs> what? A hundred and fifty dollars? $150? Oh $150? Another $10 oh on top of that with the oh black and another Hall of Fame edition <laughs> on top of that. So this is oh $170. Oh is this God. not getting out of control? But the thing is oh, that like if you do God. it's only like $12 a month to play a game you play oh, all the time. Oh man. And if you go out uh, if you go out drinking, you probably spend that much in a night. Oh, so man. by sports view, by, by sports uh game fan logic, this is cheap. Oh man. It's out of control. Yep. And it needs fucking stop. Oh. Stop this sick filth. Nope. Oh, man. Wait, so they have been? They have been charging for player packs, player builds, character clothes, shoes, <laughs> bikes, Gatorade, and skill boosts for your character. Do you have, like, an electrolyte meter? And once it gets too low, he you misses do. all the free throws? You do. How does this work? Bro, you don't even you know. An electrolyte bar, you got a 50% chance of hitting a three-pointer. Bro, he's being funny. But that's how it actually works. Gatorade and skill boosts for your character. Bro, they give you extra stamina. See, look, look. They give you extra stamina, so you gotta buy Gatorade. There's three Gatorade Gatorades. They're very expensive, bro. Especially overall. If you're some type of main ball handler, you really need them hoes. It's crazy. And now battle passes. Yeah. What the? F That's right. That's right. Gaming industry needs another crash. This stuff is unacceptable. Be careful what you wish for. The answer to why this continues is not only happening, getting worse. Majority of gamers casuals continue to support this practice. Yeah, it's just that simple. It will not stop mm -hmm. until the people spending their money on it. Yeah, true. Uh, as a basketball fan, it's great to see one of the audience talk about this. NBA 2K has been predatory ever since 2K14. That was almost three years ago. After it's jumped to Xbox One and PS4, hope he continues to talk about this. What's on top of that $70? You can spend another $50 to make one character that you might get messed up on due, due to getting the game release day. Oh my God. The company named 2K refers to the amount of money that they want you to spend for each game they make. You know what? Give it a few more years and that's going to be true. The Pro Pass and Hall of Fame is stupid. Um, apparently uh, 2K dropped this tweet. In NBA 2K24, the seasonal progression track will now combine. Let's we'll see what Agent got to say. What's the, what's the season pass tweet? Oh, NBA 2K is introducing two premium season pass options to 2K24. The Pro Pass and Hall of Fame Pass provides players with access to 40 additional earnable premium rewards. <laughs> Get on them, Agent. Come on. Come on, Agent. To reach level 40. There are two versions of the season pass. The Come on, pass Agent. Hall of Fame pass. Hold on, before they get to explain that, that's insane. Kyle, I'm fucking five, get the sub dog. All right, Kyle, thank you so much, Bob. Come on, Kyle, Agent. Fucking buzz, man. Don't be using the chat. Don't be using the chat. I think, like, I think, like, it's not the Fortnite effect, right? Season pass existed before Fortnite. <clears throat> Fortnite is fine doing season passes because the game is free, right? Uh, and Fortnite oh. season passes is all aesthetic things. You know 2K is willing to cross that line. 2K is not going to stop. You see? These fraud YouTubers, dog. You have to get them off their knees. Take them off their knees. You feel me? Take them off their knees, bro. They are taking too many loads from 2K, bro. Come on, man. Stop at aesthetic things. They will, we are perfectly fine monetizing anything if it makes some money. Facts, you me? But let's see what the other pass is in the other pass. Standard the pro pass, pass, pass unlocks an additional 40 premium rewards on the reward track and four automatic rewards <laughs> applied to your <laughs> NBA 2K account. With the Hall of Fame pass, you will get everything that's in the pro pass along with one additional automatic reward. 10 loss gifts and 15% off the season. Oh, oh, look at AJ. <laughs> I mean, the game is $70. I think this version is like fucking $5,000. I don't even know, like. <laughs> bro, we gotta pay full price for a game. Oh, and then we gotta, man. You don't have to get Bro, bro, I need an editor like this, bro. Come on, man. Come on, man. All the weirdos. Y'all y'all are obsessed with Ice Spice, bro. Oh, my God. How do you do this? Someone teach me how to do this, bro. Put that in my video. Pass, I guess. They didn't clarify what a premium award was. Maybe, I'm hoping it's not animations. That's gonna be nuts. Bro, you know what they gonna do, Agent. You already you know. You know what it is, man? We be letting shit fly, bro. That's look, what bro, it is. Look, <laughs> look, look, look. <laughs> look, look, look. Crack down on password sharing. Bro, look, 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 look. The, all the creators have already exposed themselves. They are frauds. They do not care about you, bro. Y'all get to hear the real from the people that don't need 2K. This the real, not the frauds. Why do y'all support the frauds? 
What are you doing? Like, damn. Everyone on the internet came together and said, I'm gonna cancel my Netflix subscription. Look. Yeah. And actually cancel the Netflix subscription. Instead, Netflix made a f money with no consequences. And then what happened literally the next month? What happened literally the next month? Disney CEO said, now on Disney Plus, they're gonna crack down on password sharing. It's one crazy company be trying. You see? And then when it flies, the others are like, we're good, we're good to go. Because whatever. You see? Whatever flat Netflix got, they're gonna get less. And Netflix survives. You, you see? For more. That's literally what it is, bro. That's literally what it is. And guess what? It's the same thing with creators. People saw creators endorsing this, and then everyone else went to do it to make sure it was clear, as it was okay. Nah, the reason I waited to post the video, I wanted y'all to show your true colors. I wanted you to show who you really are. I've been telling y'all, they not real. Let's see what Chris Move gotta say. Now, Chris Move, I heard you, you had some great things to say, dog. So, I might have to unban you from the park, my boy. I ain't gonna lie, this made me proud. Game, so you can take a look at that. I also wanna give my reaction to the paid season pass that is debuting with 2K24 for next gen. I think the paid season pass is a big fat L. Yep. This is gonna be so dangerous for the franchise going forward. Yup. This is the first year they're doing it, so maybe it's gonna be all cosmetic, but you know in the future, they're gonna start putting the good stuff behind that paywall. They look, might put the badges that you get at the end. Look, but when I say it, I'm crazy, I'm hater, I'm negative. Oh my God, oh, I'm, I'm such a bad person. But when someone else said they they start to adjust, right? It's all about the numbers, my boy. The season there, they might put animations. Maybe they say, hey, you want the curry slide uh -huh. or you want this other overpowered animation? You gotta get the pro pass and then level uh -huh. up to be able to get it. But even if it is all cosmetic, they've already broken the rules by giving you VC and my team points. You know how difficult it is to earn VC in the game. Mm -hmm. And you know in my team how difficult it is to get my team points. So the fact that they're like, hey, if you pay us, then you'll have the chance. And guess what? You can't pay for it with VC. Oh, chance to level up and get more of the my team points or the VC. That doesn't sit right with me. I don't know how any of you could look at that and say, yeah, this uh -huh. is a good thing. We can't forget that this because they're not real people, bro. Game is designed for you to be in a VC deficit at all times, because uh -huh. if you're playing online, especially <laughs> if you're playing in the park, they have Gatorade boost and skill boost that give you an advantage. But if you spend your VC on those items, per how do you hear he's exposing the game's design? To where you're always in a VC deficit, especially if you're whore and you never play stage. You can't earn VC, which with the amount that you actually use it, bro. You feel me? For game to play in the park, because in the park you don't make as much VC. You're not gonna make the VC back that it costs to get all those boosts. Uh -huh. So you're either gonna have to take your own money to get more VC, or you're just gonna not use the boost. But then the people that are spending money to use Gatorade uh -huh. boost and the jump shot boost, the steel boost, all that stuff, they're gonna have an advantage over you. I don't yep. see how people are not talking about this. Because they are fake people, bro. They just want to use people for their own means, and they don't care about them. People lack empathy, especially within the entertainment world. Those people are the ones that truly lack the real empathy. They just want to use their fans and act like they care about them when they really don't. Especially with this season pass, with the way that they're just throwing it in your face, like, hey, we'll give you some extra VC if you pay. No, they need to get more VC without paying. They uh -huh. need to get rid of the Gatorade boost and the skill boost. They either need. Do y'all know someone like me, me alone, I hold so many creators accountable. If I did not exist, do y'all know how crazy the 2K community would be? All the stuff they would be pushing for and accepting. Me alone, I make people tweet about things i make people make videos on certain things i make them hold like i make i hold them accountable bro you feel me literally just the existence of me because no one else is gonna do it no one else is calling these creators out bro that's crazy dog agent gone <laughs> and agent agent was you know you know philip defranco with it right but me i'm gonna tell you the real i ain't gotta call you you know I'm telling you the real, and they know it's true. So there's no reason to get mad at it. It's the truth, bro. It's literally the truth, man. You need to make it to where you can afford to continue to buy that stuff by playing the game, uh -huh. or just get rid of it all together. Because why do we even need Gatorade boosts and all these skill boosts? It shouldn't yep. even be there. It's just a way yep. to extract your VC, to put you at a VC yep. deficit, to get you to pay, <laughs> yep. to spend more money. Now they want you to pay just yep. to participate. When I tweet about it, you're complaining, you're crying. Bro, why even complain? They're never gonna change it. Slave mindset, bro. Sad. Participate and get the best rewards as they're calling it. 
per season. It's not like that season passes the whole year. I think that price is per season. Yep, per season. I am season. not a fan of that season pass. If it uh -huh. has success, who knows what they're going to do with it in the exactly. future. But as far as I'm concerned, they've already broken the rules by giving 2K my team points extra and also better VC. Get all those Because they don't even give you VC. They've never given us VC just for playing it for free in the mm -hmm. levels. And I doubt they're going to give you VC in the free levels either. So mm -hmm. it's just like, man. They're doing you dirty. They're finessing. Mm -hmm. I don't think 2K gamers understand that they're getting finessed by that they season pass. Don't. That's my reaction. They my don't. Song. Oh, man. Now, let's see what Flight Reacts got to say, man. Get on one. If it's, if, see, the thing is that I don't have any problem with currency. You know what I'm saying? If everybody, like, you know what I'm saying? Or at least, like, which is, like, know that, like, something is set in stone. Yeah, bro. I think what, like, what, what if they make it, like, current gen to where, like, the game plays better, bro? People will play both telling you dog just be straight up like negative like i'm gonna give i'll give small credit for where it's due but i'm not gonna blaze like bro this setting of this just from the looks of it compared to like the city on the park where you have to like walk like 25 and a half miles just to get to a damn you know what i'm saying like destination bro without a damn uh, a vehicle or a scooter or a skateboard mm -hmm. bro this just looks more convenient it looks like you can just drop down in here and dead ass just be able to just like you know this like six yep. courses just like each thing you got the wreck right here it's probably not that far of a it should walk. be less though the stores, like down there you know what i'm saying but at the same time which gameplay is going to be better? That's what it's going to come down to. Is gameplay going to be better on next gen or is it going to be better on current gen? You know what I'm saying? That's where the problems start to come in because people are going to just continue to experiment the first two to three months of the game and really don't know which to pick. You know what I'm saying? But I will say that I feel like next gen will take the upper hand when it comes to gameplay. You have all these new engines and all this type of part takes over, bro. Like in, in, in 2K24, just by the look at the setting, it just looks a lot more easier. To yo, yo, that's the most negative thing I heard. This yo. Is so dangerous for the franchise going forward. This hey, is you heard the man Chris Smooth. He said it right there. 2K, take that shit right now i was not expecting them to be that harsh about it i was mm -hmm. like kind of like uh, like should it be i just wanted to hear more details about it bro what is 2k thinking bro you see what i'm saying like 2k it makes sense like bro, but like you see version of the games they these guys is like low-key snakes bro like 2k knows mm -hmm. what they're doing they're becoming more of a money 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 built franchise you can take a look at that i also want to give my reaction to the like, paid season pass and you know I, my team i will say to get my team. i don't agree at all with the paid season pass it's a it's a huge up mm -hmm. 300 but the only positive thing that I can think about this coming from, will this mean that people's mob players be a lot more exclusive? You know what I'm saying? Meaning that everybody won't potentially have the same mob player because they're not going to like be able to either like pay, uh, want to pay for the pay season or pay for it in time. You know what I'm saying? Because it switches up every, you know what I'm saying? Like so often, you know what I'm saying? Will this necessarily mean that everybody- It's not you know, a you know, W, Flight. Like. Still, you know, copy and paste, file the trend, this and that on certain It's not a and all W. Stuff. Will this mean that there'll be more exclusive players? Like, that's the no. only positive thing I can see. But everything that's else- That's not positive. But like, bro, that is a damn fat L, bro. It's making people uh, have to pay for the game more. Flight, 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 listen, listen. It's not a positive. I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to tell you why. Because then people are going to be more enticed to try to keep up with those players. You feel me? So they're going to buy it. They're going to, you know? Or, like, that means that at the game, you have to pay $150 for it, right? For, like, the everything exclusive and all that types of stuff on it. Have it early, uh, play it early and all that type. Like, that means that, like, you're, how much are they going to charge to pay season? I'm going to just say, like, $20 or something like that. You know what I'm saying? In about like six months, technically, you guys, everybody's gonna be like, damn, you're paying like three, four hundred dollars just for 2K alone. And that's mm -hmm. without all the like extra stuff you're gonna be buying with like the uh, my uh -huh. career, my park mode, and all that stuff. And the my team on top of that, bro, they can damn near bundle uh -huh. down to a thousand dollar game within uh -huh. the first like six months. If you think every about it, year. yo, 2K, they, every they become, year. Like, a designer type of a video game, bro. Next thing hey. you know, they're gonna be charging like 6,500 for like exclusive copies of 2K and everything. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> they is finessing, bro. I don't know how any of you could look at that and say, yeah, this is a good thing. No, nah, it's not a good thing at all. And like, that's, like I said, like there's only like one little positive thing that you can take from it, if, even if that's gonna even be the case, and me drawing back into saying that like, potentially people's my players are gonna be more exclusive and be a lot more different, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, you're just having to pay more for the- <laughs> I don't think 2K gamers <laughs> understand that they're getting finessed no, by that season for, pass. No, for real, bro. That's my like, reaction. bro, like, if I was, nah, bro, like, I'd be so tight, bro, like, especially, like, you just, like, you know what I'm saying, a kid and stuff, you just chilling at school, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, like, imagine you having to, like, bro, that's just, nah, that, that's an L, bro. Like, forget, like, even, like, a part of saying, like, exclusive my players and, like, my career and all that type of stuff, like, players will be different, bro. This is just taking advantage of just, like, the newer generation, like, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying, gamers that's coming up and everything like that, bro. Yep. Like, whoever, like, approved this for this to happen, bro, you guys have a season pass in 2k imagine like back in like even like 2k16 because like you guys remember 2k16 through like 18 i wasn't on and i took a break from like 2k and all that stuff throughout those th throughout those like three years i probably had like maybe like four or five videos total maybe you know what i'm saying like throughout that's that time a blessing period, like, you know what i'm saying i was even all that type of stuff and i know how strong 2k was back imagine you in 2k16 having to pay a season pass bro you coming off from school firing up the fuck, you know what i'm saying and you have to pay a season pass people don't think like that bro or whatever or have this different unlockable badge and everything people people don't have empathy man they don't have empathy bro like that man like bro that's just straight up taking advantage of the community and it's literally becoming like a money hungry franchise you don't even care about having uh -huh. a good video game and the passion of basketball it's just whatever you can just get out of everybody bro and like, uh -huh. like truthfully like all the devs like whoever approved all this stuff bro like you're evil you're evil as uh -huh. you ain't, bro that's just uh -huh. pathetic, it's pathetic bro. this is a scumbag move at its uh -huh. price you know what i'm saying it took a minute from anyone endorsing it too you forgot to add that
for it to process throughout the video. But bro, this is the biggest scumbag move, like at its finest, bro. Like I don't uh -huh. know like what bills are you low on and like how low are you <laughs> to go down to do this, bro. This isn't it. This isn't it, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's already enough with you know what I'm saying, having uh, two different games, you know what I'm saying, on current gen and next gen, and then you have the like a uh, uh, VC and all that all that type of stuff, uh -huh. the player builds you have to go through. And then not even let let alone with that, you know what I'm saying? Everybody that makes a my career player, you have to remember, even me, like for 2K22, this is like the first time I really had to go through it in multiple years. I had to make two different my players. I actually uh -huh. had to make, you know what I'm saying, another my player because and flight don't be caring. Imagine if you care, you know? Flight don't be caring. You have to be a certain type of person to not really be caring, just be playing, you know? Imagine if you care. You know, a lot of NPCs ain't gonna be pulling up on you and stuff, right? So you might you might have to face harder comp and stuff. Hey, uh, you know, I'm just saying. Is I low key messed up because you have to adapt to how cheesers and how ex and you know exploiters play. You know what I'm saying? So you have to mm -hmm. you know create you know what I'm saying a different player build or whatever like that. Uh -huh. just like for whatever reason you can't score. You know you know how you have to. Uh -huh. in so like not everybody's guaranteed to only have that one player. So what if somebody has to make another player? So you're you're even topping more money. Come on, man. This is this is terrible, bro. <laughs> this isn't it, man. Hey, y'all make sure y'all go check out this video. They said it was my best one ever. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. We're talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.